This is the problem number 12 of VTU C programming lab course uh, in which the problem statement is given two university information files student name dot text and usn dot text that contains student name and usn respectively write a C program to create a new file called output dot text copy the contents of file student name dot text and usn dot text into an output file in the sequence given below. Display the content of output dot text onto the screen. So basically the problem statement is create a new uh, so create a new uh, new file called output dot text and copy the content of the file student name dot text and usn dot text into output file sequence given below so they want it in this format okay so basically this is a typical uh, file operation so these are the things you should remember anything with file you should include stdlib dot h along with stdio dot h so both uh, if you include you will get all file operations and uh, this file star is something you need to remember this is a standard defined C library data structure called file for doing any file operation so this data structure works well with fopen, fclose, fscanf, fprintf and fio so let me quickly go through the different uh, functions we are going to use it is a f open f is file file open it takes a file name as a character and different mode so the there are a few other mode but simplest mode is we you open it for read that means we the file is already exist we use it for write that means even if there is already a file it's going to erase it and create a new file with the same name okay so whatever the earlier content gets deleted append is something is a better than write if it is not present it's going to uh, create it and then append it so if you're opening multiple times so uh, for example for some database you have 10 entries today next day you have another 10 so you, you can use a to keep appending to the same output file okay the syntax is if the if it is going to successful it returns a pointer to the file object if fails it returns null okay so he, this is how typically we use f open we give a file num file name and a read if it returns zero then there is some problem file is not present or something report error we start use your this for any file operation if scanf is similar to regular scanf but it is for the file it it on, the only difference addition is it takes the file stream like what we are given here okay and uh, the same scanf all the operation percent d for integer c for character s for string is uh, uh, applies here also on success returns the number of items read on failure reads e eof the this is an important one where it is a file end of file so when we are writing uh, when we are reading automatically we don't know how long that content is because we have no clue so using this we get to know whether we have reached to the end of the file or not so if it uh, we are at the end of the file it returns a non-zero value and if it is not good case it returns zero that's why we are checking if it is not of zero that means it is true either this file has a content or this file has a content we are going to do a f scan f give this file pointer and do a percentage s and read it to the here and this file printf is going to be the same but it needs a file pointer okay and rest so whatever the printf does here is written onto this file with the pointing fp3 okay so let's quickly go to the code uh, where in which uh, let's see what's happening 
So this is a typical code I have included a stdlib along with a stdio.io and there are three file pointers so that's why you should be very careful. You should, this is not a pointer, this is the pointer, that's right? File star fp1, star fp2, star fp3. So for each you have to mention give a star and these two are local variable usn and name. Sometimes the turbo c has a problem with the length of the file name. Okay, so that's why I suggest uh, use a shorter name like s name and usn. So it does not matter. And one other important thing, very critical one, is you whatever the editor you are doing, you create open a file in that editor only. Okay, don't use Windows uh, Notepad or something to edit this thing because there is a problem uh, with the uh, file if you create on Windows, uh, it creates in DOS mode and uh, some other Ubuntu or any other thing won't take it, right? So it's highly recommended whatever editor you use, same, I'm using a sname.txt as my uh, input, I've opened here, okay, so uh, I j have just uh, key one uh, alpha I mean alphabetical order so that you get to know the thing I've ended at F then let me open uh, usn dot text also okay this is its name and uh, This is the USN intentionally I have given some sequential number for you to get it. Okay. So coming back here and also let me open output dot text. So this is already written in this format. So I'll just delete it our function had written save output you can have or delete it doesn't matter okay so what we are doing here in this is we are reading a if open a file name and it's only for reading purpose similarly usn for reading purpose but output we are doing a f open with the right so whatever content is there, it's going to delete it. If file is not there, it's going to create its own. If it returns error, we have a handler here. And uh, so here what you could do is if, if f open of fp1 is equal to 0, that means the file has a content. Uh, it's not gone to the end of it. And f op, feof of fp2 is equal to 0, that means if two fi files the sname.x and usn.x has not reached to the end of it. So we have a, a, a scanf here which takes a, from this file string uh, file fp1 pointer. We read the entry and uh, put it into local variable name. Same is for fp2 which we have read for usn.x reading here. And this is an fprinter with a fp3. fp3 points to the output dot tags. We are writing in what it is asked as student name and USN number. Okay. So once we wrote, we can close this file if oh, close, f close, f close. And again, they say if you do it, then you open the output dot x in read form and print the uh, student output of output dot text in this format. So we are reading the a name and USN percentage percentage and printing here under an F close that's it so the whole core logic is we open uh, uh, we have three file pointers FP1 FP2 FP3 so FP1 use opens the S name dot text you could also use the full what they have given is student name but sometime what I have seen is especially the turbo c has a problem with the lengthy name so keep it short short and simple 
then the FP2 is used to open the USN in read mode, FP3 is used to open output.txt in write mode and this is the core algorithm, just this is, I am marking everywhere the core algorithm, is this is the simple core algorithm, in a for loop till the file end of file, FEOF end of file has reached till it is not reached in a loop, read the scanf, the name from the fi first file, then the USN from the second file, print it in percentage, percentage format, close it. Then the second one is you open again the output.txt and you can check either this is also a valid one while FEOF is equal to is equal to 0. That means we we are if there is a file end of file has not reached that's why it is 0 then read again the name and uh, USN note, note it is percentage s then the print okay so let me quickly compile uh, here zero error and run now you can see that uh, the uh, name and USN number has put it in the order so let me open the output.txt output.txt see if it has written in the same format what the prob the program expected to okay i'm just saving let's try one more experiment let me open uh, its name.txt instead of this I'll give a valid names we'll start with uh, Akshata then this is Bhargav Akshata Bhargav Chetan Deepak then uh, Desh, Rajesh, Ramya are the names. Okay. I have like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. Just to uh, make it end, uh, let me give some string just for our testing purpose. I closed the close. Let me open usn.s and usn uh, let me keep it the same then uh, window close compile run so so it is coming till the printing till the end okay so let's check so if it is zero and both of them are zero then only it is printing okay so this is the output what we expect and uh, let me quickly go through the things again. So the output what they want us in this format, we did it. Output dot text, student name dot text. I've used as s name dot text. Keyword is uh, std lib file star. F open format is like this. We have to give. We gave. F open within the double quote s name dot text in read format and uh, output dot text in write w f scan f it takes the file uh, stream the percentage fd the fp1 what we have here and uh, it's a regular scan f the end of 
file FEOF returns 0 if it is not at end of file or else it returns a non-zero value. Okay. Uh, that's it. 